Hey guys, so I am here with the Fashion Fair Perfect Finish Cream Makeup which is a cream to powder foundation. I have it in the color 4452 Brown Sugar. And I'm going to apply this side with the e.l.f. small stipple brush and this other side with a sponge. When I went to the store to be color matched, um, the sales lady used a sponge, which it applies beautifully with both, but I just wanted to show you the difference of the two. So here is the packaging, obviously, and this is the compact, comes with a mirror, and here is the brown sugar color, and also, this is, I've noticed this is very popular um, with the two compartments, especially with MAC foundations, and then it comes with a sponge, which I have not used, and the sponge has the sort of... Not perforated, but it has the holes for breathability for the sponge. This is a swatch of a color, and this color matches my skin perfectly. I don't know if you're even gonna be able to see it. There's a swatch. I'll put a swatch on my hand as well. And there's a swatch where it looks lighter on my hand, but as you can see on my face, it you know it matches pretty well. I'm, as you can tell, I'm really yellow in this area here, and then more reddish on the outer sides of my face. So let me go ahead and use this sponge. I'm gonna look in the viewfinder just so I can see. And I don't have foundation on, obviously. And here, and then it just, and it has like a, a, a floral, not floral, it kinda has like a soapy smell. You know when you go to public bathrooms and they have that soap in there. It kind of has that kind of feminine fragrance. I can't really put my finger on what it is, but it's a feminine fragrance. The foundation. And this is the side without. And actually the side with the foundation <laughs> looks even more, excuse my dry lips, looks even more natural. I'm looking at the viewfinder. Looks even more natural than my actual skin. It really evens out my skin. It's some of the yellow in my skin is still peeking through here, like under the eyes, but it blends the two colors so well. Now I'm gonna go in with the stippling brush. And of course this is gonna pick up more product And if you have dry skin like myself, I would highly suggest you put on a serum or a light moisturizer before applying it. Let that dry in your skin, but put on a light moisturizer because this is going to pick up the dry patches in your skin. I have a really bad dry patch here. And I don't think the camera lighting is even doing this foundation any justice. So again, this is 4452 Brown Sugar. I really love the foundation, it's light. It, I don't think it needs to be set because it's a cream to powder, so it, the finish is a powder finish. So I think it's definitely medium to full coverage. I'm gonna go put some lipstick on and maybe some blush to kind of finalize the look and I will come back in a second. Okay, so I have come back and I put on blush, lipstick, and mascara. So you can see how the foundation, pretty much the color that you put it on once you blend it in, it's already set and it doesn't oxidize. Probably, I'm guessing that's because it is a cream foundation and not a liquid. So um, I really like this foundation. My lighting is making it look yellow because usually I use daylight but obviously it's dark right now so the lighting is kind of off and probably too because I have on this yellow shirt but what I will do is I will insert a picture here of how the actual foundation looks in better lighting 
and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you've tried Fashion Fair, I know they have sort of revamped the formula of their makeup. So don't sleep on Fashion Fair. If you've tried this cream foundation, please let me know. Let me know your thoughts. And the only con I can think of is that this foundation does have parabens in it. And I believe it's just one. It does have the Profil Paraben. So that's the only downside I could find of this foundation. So Fashion Fair, if you're watching, please, for us ladies who are um, natural product lovers, if you could find an alternative for that paraben, that would be awesome. But other than that, I love this foundation. It makes me look like a doll. <laughs> if you haven't already, please be sure to like this video if you found it helpful. And please be sure to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye!